here is the extensor carpi radialis longus and the extensor carpi radialis brevis. If I highlight the radius, we can see that they attach on the side of the radius. Extensor carpi tells us that these muscles extend the wrist. Radialis tells us that they attach on the side of the radius. And to distinguish between the two muscles, we use the words longus and brevis. To tell the difference between the two, we use the mnemonics we already covered in a previous video. This muscle attaches to the base of the middle finger, the finger used for the bird. B for bird equals B for brevis. This muscle attaches to the base of the first finger, and for this one I trace up the finger and out to the thumb, giving me an L. It works for the left hand and gives a backward L for the right. And we use the L to remember longus. The proximal attachment for these muscles is the lateral epicondyle of the humerus, and as we have seen before, it is the common attachment of the extensors. Here, we can see these muscles with the other muscles of the arm. And here are the muscles in clay. First, I'm making the brevis, which is the one that attaches to the base of the middle finger. Next, I will attach the longus.